such an incredible week with iconic scenes. And 600 background, all fans of the show. And I'm sure you saw the headlines. It definitely added some mystery to the week. As of this moment, we don't know if we're filming tomorrow. The Screen Actors Guild at midnight tonight will likely go on strike. We have too much to shoot and not enough days to do it. We're hoping we can finish the season. So never mind, we actually don't know what's happening. One of the absolute biggest Bible stories. Oh man, is there gonna be anything happy in this video? What is it like comforting the savior of the world? Nope. Wow, it breaks my heart in a million pieces because I know how important Lazarus and his family is to him. They've been like his own family. From the first moment, I haven't talked to him since Lazarus passed. I wonder how he's taking it, how, how he's doing. It breaks my heart, but of course I understand where this is coming from. Some other dude comes out, it's not Lazarus. Hey, what's going on? I'm Carl. <laughs> <laughs> so while I can't show you anything about this scene, I can show you what happens when the heat gets to everyone. Now, I have no idea where these little rubber hands came from, but when you're sitting there filming these scenes that are amazing and iconic, but also heavy, it's nice to have those moments of fun. Mitch brought some, and Danny brought some, and then it was just, it just made me so happy. God, little hands, children. <laughs> Not only do we have 600 background here, we have a little bit added pressure. What's going on? So as of this moment, we don't know if we're filming tomorrow. The Actors Union at midnight tonight will likely go on strike. Because we're independent, we could be exempt from the strike, but we don't know yet if that's going to be approved. We're still gonna show up, start shooting stuff without actors, waiting for the news. Problem with that is, is it delays us. And every single second counts on these days because we have too much to shoot while we're here in Utah and not enough days to do it. I'm trying to just focus on today, but it's hanging over our heads. My heart is so full, I'm so excited you are here. You're doing things we can't do, we're doing things you can't do. We're each putting together our five loaves and two fish, and we're gonna watch God do amazing things. I can adjust to what I know. That happens all the time on set. The hardest thing to do is not to know what's gonna happen. Put out 15 different scenarios instead of two. Worst case scenario is that, uh, is that yeah, that we don't get to work. Like, comment, and subscribe. What was amazing was the joy that 600 of you brought. Having that many people here to experience this with us, that adds so much energy, it makes it easier on us to make those scenes special and what they are. It wouldn't be the same without them. A few years ago, my daughter passed away. The Chosen really allowed me to just reconnect with God and just get out of that grief. Life-changing for me. That's why when this opportunity came, I really wanted to be a part of it. It's amazing. You know, we feed off of their energy. They kept us going during the feeding of the 5,000 yes. in that 110 degree weather. Anytime we started to feel exhausted, we just had to look at them and their excitement and it brought us back up. So I, I love those days. Today is a very special day because it's our mom's birthday in heaven. This is our second year without her. Um, she loved The Chosen. Normally we would go to her favorite beach to celebrate her birthday and um, I'm like she would rather us be here doing this. It's amazing the encouragement and joy you all bring anytime you come and visit set. Now we know SAG and AFTRA are looking up for the best interest of our actors and while there was a time of uncertainty for production, it was awesome to have you there. Time for real honesty. How optimistic are you? I am very optimistic that God has a plan and that no matter what, we're a better example on how we're acting while we're waiting on the results than we are by getting the news we want to have. We're hoping within the next six hours that we'll have information so that tomorrow doesn't get disrupted. Here we are, Friday. We are filming today, but today is historic. Since we don't have cast here today, your cue today will be action. Today we are filming everything we can without actual cast. Now do you think chances are good we'll get the exemption coming down today? I don't know. That's the thing. Loaves and fish, man. We'll see what uh, God has in store. Now something Jelaine and I cannot truly stress enough is just how great the atmosphere was that day as we were filming. We filmed some truly epic scenes, but don't take my word for it. I think some of the stuff we shot this week was pretty historic. This is stuff that will stick with movie history for a long time. Can't tell you or show you anything of what we just filmed. I will just tell you that I got chills. On Monday, we have some good news, don't we, Chad? We are shooting with our actors. SAG has been really great to work with. We can only imagine the bombardment they were facing for projects like ourselves. We're in the home stretch here and we're just very thankful to be going again. We get to end on a happy note. We got our waiver from SAG, which means that we get to finish out the last two weeks of filming. So make sure you like and subscribe and we can't wait to see you again.